Hey, hi everyone. Welcome to HR Topper. First of all, I would like to thank you for watching this video. Once again, welcome to HR Topper family. First request, have patience. Have patience. If you want to understand about HR Topper, I need some time, at least half an hour to know in details so that you can take a wise decision in choosing this course. So at present, if you are watching and you are busy, then I suggest or recommend watch it when you are free. It will take approximately half an hour. Let's start. <clears throat> Coming to the point, why to choose HR Topper? Why you have to do the course from HR Topper? By end of the session, you will come to know how HR Topper can become your partner in success and career growth. Now, we need to understand few things. So I have categorized into two groups. One, fresher, one, experienced. Correct? So two things I have, I will explain you with my experience and tell you what exactly we all are facing. <clears throat> First, before we go to the practical thing let us understand the base the concept if you understand this one point you will be very clear in your life first is education sector now what is education sector what we study what we have done what we have learned and what is corporate sector what we do inside the company what we have studied and what we do inside the company both are different example what we study is a theoretical knowledge and what we do inside the organization is a practical knowledge. Example, we learn everything through books, notes and everything. But what we do inside the organization, we work on the laptop, software, Excel, Word, PowerPoint. That is not taught in the organization how to conduct an interview that is not being told practically. Whatever we have learned is theoretical and what we do is practical. And in the education, we don't learn practical. And in the organization, we never refer a book. In my 19 years career, I never referred any kind of books that I've learned from first standard till my degree. Example I'm telling, even if you have done MBA, that will not be helpful for you. Am I clear? <clears throat> why people do MBA? Why people do MBA? Spend lakhs of rupees on their higher education. They do masters, postgraduate, diploma, any higher education. Why you do MBA? Because to get a good job, good career, good organization. Even though many people are still struggling to get job. Most of the people have joined as a trainee. They, you know that many students who are taking the course have shared their experience that they were working free. They are working free for 8 to 10 hours. Instead of sitting idle, they thought they will go and join the company and get some knowledge because every organization is looking for the practical knowledge and experience, not the theoretical knowledge. Many people have landed up, landed up into the recruitment profile then why people spend lots of money in higher education? The truth is, <clears throat> when we recruit a candidate, the first preference is given to a master's, the higher education, example, MBA or master's, whatever you feel. The first priority means, if I want to recruit a profile, I will first select the MBA people, the masters who have done the masters. Then the second priority goes to the postgraduate, PG, then diploma, then degree. Undergraduate are not there only. Got that idea? So people do MBA so that they get the first priority. What people think, students think, if I invest and do MBA, I will get a job. That is not correct. We don't get job based on the degree or education. We get job based on something else, which I will definitely explain. So and second, you know, what I've seen in my career, <clears throat> most of the people nowadays doing dual specialization. Example, HR, 
with finance or sales. So what happens is when they go for a placement, when they go for a placement, they get more opportunity for the finance and sales, not in HR. The logic is in HR department, hardly two to five people are working, but in a finance team, there are 10 people working in sales team, 20 people are working. So where is more vacancy either in the finance or sales? So it becomes very difficult to get job in the HR department. So people convert into finance or sales. And after a few years, they realize that it is not their style, their taste. So they change the industry. They, come, they want to come back to HR department. Am I clear? This is also is the problem. <clears throat> Let's go to the next one. So the technical question is, on what basis candidate get a job? Many people say, sir, degree, education, experience, knowledge. Let's go into the practical part now. <clears throat> Corporate company company wants to connect source a candidate connect with a candidate what is the medium and mode company wants to recruit someone but how they recruit what is important the first most important thing is your resume so the corporate gets connected with the candidate through resume so if your resume is not good not proper not correct not in a professional way do you think you will get the job? Job is a secondary part. First is shortlisted. So the first part in getting the job is shortlist, which is based on your resume, not on a degree. Am I very clear? So friends, I also have an option for resume writing. If you want, you can learn from us. Nothing wrong. It's hardly 369 rupees where I've given my experience and what I expect as an HR head from you, how the resume should be. You will be able to prepare your own resume. Okay. No need to spend 2000, 3000 rupees to someone who will prepare your resume. Uh, no one other, no other person should prepare. It is you and the information is about you. So I have thought how to prepare in a very simple way. <clears throat> so the first important is resume writing. 95% of the people don't get job just because of this resume. Second is phone interview, how to communicate, what to ask, not to ask. So the phone interview is the second most important for getting a job. That also uh, the course is there. Okay? <clears throat> the third one, once you get shortlisted and you are in the interview panel, what is important? They will never ask a question related to your education. They will not ask you that from where you have done your education, what percentage you have got, that is you have already mentioned in the resume. You have done MBA, that is enough. From where you have done, how much percentage you have got, that doesn't matter because we know that what you have learned has no connection with the organization. Once you come inside the organization, it's totally a different world. So freshers, those who have done MBA, please note whatever you have done, learned is good. You will get the first priority, not job. Got it, dear? <clears throat> you get selected on the basis of your knowledge and skill. Got it? Chalo, let's move. So third point, knowledge and skill. Now I recommend what you can do. You have completed your degree, no problem at all. The first most important is you have to learn typing. You know why typing? 99% when, when you join the company, 99% you will be typing only either writing, whatever you do, typing. That means you are working on an Excel, PowerPoint, software, but still you are typing. 99% you are typing. So if you enhance that typing skill, you will complete your work faster. I'll give you a live example. Let's say I am a graduate person and you are gold medalist from the London University. Example, okay. I'm an I'm a graduate or undergraduate. You are a gold medalist from London University. You have done the MBA. <clears throat> job. The boss has given us a job to type and come. So you have taken one hour. I have taken just ten minutes. What is the difference? Because I I have done the typing. So I have completed within ten minutes, and you took one hour. Nearby one hour. Now, what is the use of the degree? Once we enter the organization, we are common. 
their education does not come their skill comes so i recommend each and every one to do or learn typing okay i request you to watch my free i'll show you in the next few slides okay remember that point second important is ms office most of the time we are working on excel preparing reports data everything which is so if a person knows formula he can complete in one minute the person who don't know formula he may take hours there's a big difference because formula have to be prepared only for one whether it are 10 employees or 10 lakh employees it takes only one minute am i very clear so ms office is the second most important part you need to learn even though if you don't have a degree or mba if you have typing and ms office you will get a job in nature i am very clear i recruit only based on these two category i don't think i don't see whether the person has done mba or not because what is useful inside the organization is typing because 99% you are typing what typing excel word and everything so that is more important <clears throat> third most important friends strategy compliance strategy compliance you cannot learn inside the organization you can learn outside the organization so all these three parameters you cannot learn inside the organization boss is not going to teach you typing or ms office statutory law the book is available purchase it and read it because this is all declared or decided by the government so it is not inside it is outside who is deciding government so law that you can learn so purchase this book it's hardly 800 to 900 rupees and you will get maximum knowledge <clears throat> now freshers why don't they get job the logic is lakhs of people crores of people are doing mba in a year so if i give you one vacancy 100 cvs i'll get of the same people same category mba so company has more choice to select let's say one position is there 10 people have come for the interview and 10 people have come from the same college or same degree so i have an option to choose the best but if the person has done mba all the same the same 10 people will have the same knowledge no because they have learnt mba but one person has to be unique different from others so company corporate company or corporate has a choice to choose the best one so if you want to be the best and stay one step ahead you have to learn the practical knowledge on the skills that i have recommended you got it <clears throat> so demand is less and the supply is more so i have more choice to choose so i request why people don't get job because they don't have the practical knowledge got that idea dear why freshers are not getting job now why even the professional that is they are working experienced people are doing the same job for so many years why the same answer because practical knowledge if they are doing recruitment they are doing recruitment only till the time they are working in that organization if they want to move to payroll or a generalist profile it is not possible because they don't have that knowledge now because of this also they don't get growth no success no promotion if the person is just going to do only one kind of work how he will become a manager hr manager or hr head it's very difficult now you have to, hr head should know all the knowledge of all the department like recruitment generalist payroll pms so many things are there correct so then the question comes from where i can learn the practical knowledge from where i can learn the practical knowledge for both huh? freshers and experience options are friends not possible colleagues definitely not family very difficult like if your dad and mom is in hr definitely they can guide you but it's not possible everywhere right so the answer comes no if all these three people are not going to teach us then who is the right person then the answer is boss your superior your boss is the only person who can teach you but the fact is he is the only person who can teach you guide you train you and motivate you no one else can do but the reality fact is your boss does not have sufficient time to sit with you and teach you all the other profiles whatever you have been shortlisted for or recruited for your jd you can do this only that work you will not be able to do any other work 
do you think your boss will teach you guide you whatever he knows he will mentor you do you think he has that sufficient time no i am also a boss so i can understand that <clears throat> do you think he will share his entire experience and knowledge with you secrets what are the skills that are that are required that he knows he knows the shortcut after 19 years i know what is the best shortcut way right do you think he will teach not possible then the, again the question comes who is the person who is going to teach the practical part the answer is someone who has worked in the organization have sufficient experience and knowledge he can teach but here there is one more myth <laughs> fact is do you think ki everyone will share their knowledge very difficult things to do so someone who has a knowledge and who is ready to share his knowledge then only you can learn the practical part here hr buddy comes for the last two years i am training and teaching and sharing my experience with all the students and professionals my name is anand mudaliar i stay in mumbai maharashtra with my family hr topper and hr buddy both are mine and i am going to share my experience with you and teach you train you guide you mentor you whatever case studies live example that i have gone through i have seen i will share with you i will make you understand the concept and share my secret tips and success to reach to this level so 19 i took 19 years to gain this knowledge which i'm giving to you ready made trust me it is not possible on completion of this course you will have more knowledge than your boss that's my guarantee second whatever knowledge i'm trying to share with you if you want to learn on your own then you have to spend 10 to 12 years to gain that knowledge <clears throat> one more question because this is the confusion what people have experience is important or knowledge is important most of the people will feel will say experience i'll give you a small example <clears throat> one person is working for the last 6 years but his designation is senior hr executive and his city is only 3 lakh why so less he has 6 years experience but still he is working at a very low level with a low salary why experience is not important knowledge is important because he is not having that knowledge same one one more person working for 6 years and he has reached to manager level and his city is 6 lakh why because he have the knowledge <clears throat> if you have the knowledge of 1 lakh you will get 1 lakh salary so what is more important knowledge or experience knowledge got it so that person have the knowledge to execute implement the processes and the policy so here i will show you the road map for success what to do when you join the company <clears throat> what to do when to do when you have to execute what you have to execute and how to execute that is practical knowledge what to do theoretical knowledge when to do theoretical knowledge how to do is a practical knowledge which i am going to share my knowledge the best one the latest one <clears throat> if you have the knowledge and you go to an organization don't you think you will get the growth fast i have given you the road map for success i have told you what you have to do the next correct so definitely success is possible after completing this course if you don't get 3000 to 5000 extra salary extra increment i am not expecting your expectation i am i am telling you more than the expectation 3 to 5000 rupees if you don't get you have wasted my time your knowledge my knowledge it's an insult to hr topper and buddy if you are having more knowledge than your boss you should get more salary also correct <clears throat> now the sec third problem you know i have seen when i speak to candidate you know for enrollment normally i have seen people ask for offline course i really don't understand ki why people are so you know used to offline but everyone wants work from home option but they don't want to go office but they want to work from home but for courses they are looking for offline so i this is the way i try to explain so let me tell you the practical part <clears throat> suppose you join my company okay what i will do let's say your name is shankar hey shankar please pull your chair 
pull up the chair and sit next to me. So definitely you will be sitting next to me. And now I'll be opening the laptop or a desktop and I'll show you the work that you have to do through laptop or desktop. There is no other media. I'm not going to take you to the conference room and open a PPT and show you everything on the presentation. No. When you join the company, you will be sitting next to your boss and who will teach you via only laptop or desktop. Now, when you are, when you are learning, you are watching, you're seeing the laptop. I am also seeing the laptop and teaching you. We both are not going to see the faces. So if you both are not watching their face, then the same thing I'm learning here also, you are watching me. I am also watching you. You have to, you are see, watching my laptop. I'm also watching my laptop. So this is practical. So friends, offline and online, both are same. The only difference is you're going to sit somewhere else. Now you're sitting at your own place. So it's an on-job training method. Got that idea? You will be watching the laptop. I'll be watching the laptop. This is what we are doing right now also. Got it? <clears throat> then I will open the same format, template, the way you have to process the salary, prepare the appointment letter, everything I will show in the same process on job training method. Got it? So <clears throat> do one thing. If you really want to know the next level of uh, still, you are not comfortable. So I'll give you one suggestion. Why don't you go to YouTube example? I'll show you. Go to the YouTube HR topper. This is the HR topper logo. I have uploaded these videos of the live session of payroll, live session of payroll and generalist, three hour session. See, two hours, 42, one hour, 13. Get practice. This is what I was telling you. Get HR practical knowledge. For two hours, two and a half hours, I have explained you from where you will get the practical knowledge for free. Even if you learn all those knowledge, you will have more knowledge than me. That is what I have explained there. So just go and watch some few live sessions and see how comfortable you are. Trust me, whoever have seen the videos, they have never rejected till now. So don't worry because you are getting more knowledge than your boss. Second, this is HR Topper. You can also go to HR Buddy. There are many more videos. Okay, I'll go to the HR Buddy. Okay, this is the shorts, reels. These are the whichever is more than one hour, it is a live session. Okay, you can go and watch many videos I have uploaded. So you will get a clarity, you will have a confidence, see some positive vibrations are coming while watching the video, but have patience to complete the video. Just watching 15 minutes, you will not understand. So I'm giving you three hours time to watch the video and get motivated and excited to join HR Topper. <clears throat> so I've shown you hrtopper.com. You can go to the YouTube and HR Buddy. Both are mine. You can watch it. So the teaching, the teaching method is practical. I will not teach you like a professor. Anyway, I don't look like a professor, nor I look like a boss and from any angle. So I'll teach you like a colleague. What is HR? What is Buddy? A colleague who have the knowledge, but he's not your boss. So I will also teach you like that. You will understand the concept, each and every subject which I'm going to teach you, you will understand the concept. One of the best, what is experience, dear? One of the best method that we learn is what I'm going to share directly to you. Not like a fresher, but from my perspective, my angle, the way I am doing the job. As an HR head, uh, what the way I was doing, I will teach you that. So each function, step by step and end to end process, you will be in a position to implement and handle independently okay wherever the formula is required you can learn <clears throat> now the fourth you know problem i've seen when i speak to the new candidate they always ask for placement this is the most important part and i want you to listen carefully now there are two ways here earlier before the online session earlier there was a offline so people were go example st i'm staying in mumbai okay my institute is in mumbai you all people who will come to Mumbai, the people who are staying nearby Mumbai, maybe one hour, two hour, they may travel to come to this location. Correct. So if it is an offline, if it is an offline, what company does, they get connected to the nearby corporates. So a person staying in Mumbai, definitely go and work in Mumbai, not in Pune. 
hypothetically. So being I'm staying in Mumbai, it is possible for me to get connected with all the corporates of Mumbai. That is possible. In some years, it is possible, not in one day. It will take time, but it is possible. But the moment it has become digitalization and online, now I'm sitting in Mumbai, you are in Delhi, how I'll come to know where you are staying? How I'll come to know which company are there nearby you? This is the practical answer, dear, technical answer. And people, just anyone is going and doing, uh, paying 40, 50,000 just because with the name of placement. Now think one question, think only one, one thing, you know, sitting in Mumbai, how a person will come to know where you stay? How a, how a company, HR topper, can get connected with all the companies of India. It will take years and years. Not a joke, dear. Not a joke. So how you can, you know, trust just by writing placement? What is placement assistant? Who are the manufacturer of placement? Institute. Because institute are connected with the corporates. If they are not in a position to give you a job, as per your choice, your dream, your desire, how can this small, small company, organization, trainer can give you the job? That is one of the reasons I don't entertain or get into placement. I will share the knowledge, which is enough for you to get a job without a placement. I'll show you why, how that I'll show you. But remember one thing, friends, investing money, 50, 60,000 in the name of placement you should think twice. Logic question, staying in Mumbai, how I'll come to know from where you are calling, which company is nearby. Is it possible that in India, how many companies will be there? Do you think possible for an individual or a company to connect to everyone? Possible? It will take years and years. So think wisely. So what, now how you get job? You want the answer after doing this course. My fees is just 0.5% of higher education. Let's say two lakh three MBA starts with lakhs of rupees. My fees is somewhere around 5,000 to 10,000 rupees. And the knowledge I'm going to share will stay with you forever till your retirement. And the way I'm teaching, this is the way you have to go and implement. Got it, dear? <clears throat> now understand the technical answer. How you will get a job? First requirement is degree, master's, which you already have. Second, I said the mediator is your resume writing, which I will teach you. Phone interview, that also I will teach you. Now you are in the panel, interview panel. What is important? They are looking practical knowledge. What I'm going to teach, 19 years, what I did inside the organization is what I'm going to share with you. So that is what corporate is expecting. For example, how to process the payroll is what I'm going to teach you. So you know 100 times better than a fresher. So what is required? Resume that I'm teaching, practical knowledge, what corporate is expecting. So when you have all these three, who will reject you? Do you really want to see the magic? Let me show you one more thing. How to sell yourself in the interview. So the first part is project. I want you to watch that uh, free practical knowledge where I've shown uh, more example and experience for two and a half hours. Now I cannot explain. So go and visit that, watch that. Trust me, it will help you. Second is live demo. How to sell yourself means when you go for an interview, 100 people are there. You have to be one step ahead. How it is possible? Would you like to see the magic? You have to do the same thing. First, see the magic. You <clears throat> first feel it. Okay. Let me show you. <clears throat> Can you see an, a CTC structure? Blank. Okay. Within five seconds, you can prepare a salary structure. Want to see that magic? Tick, tick one, tick, tick two, tick, tick three, tick, tick four, tick, tick five. I've just made it a little slow. Within five seconds, can you see the salary structure, which was blank? Now, during the interview, take your laptop along with you. If example I'm telling, if you're going for a payroll, just open the laptop and tell me, ma'am, can you give me only one minute? I'll show you a magic. And trust me, after watching that, you will, not, you will select me. Open that laptop and show them this. 
but remember one thing you cannot just copy my format and show them this magic suppose if i am the h uh, i am the recruiter what i will say can you prepare right now in front of me you should say yes of course yes ma'am i will prepare right now you start preparing but if you have not learned and just copy pasted my uh, this excel definitely you are not going to win the game so you have to practice if you know how to prepare which is what i'm going to teach and you have done the practice tell me one reason why people will reject second example can you see the full and final settlement full and final settlement means when the person leave the organization we have to process his salary can you see everything blank just by putting the employee code most of the information has been extracted from the data automatically like a software even the gratuity calculation has come automatically wow do you think the recruiter will reject you for any reason they will say at can you explain me this can you teach me this can you share me the uh, excel sheet trust me i'll tell you they will tell you one thing can you share this excel file i'll get back to you on this that's it because they want to know the formula so it's okay you can share with them nothing wrong tell me one reason friend why suppose i am the candidate you are the recruiter why you will reject me the person who knows automatic calculation even the salary register also you can prepare in just 5 minutes any one reason to reject no so now tell me why you need placement assistant why you need <clears throat> guarantee when you know everything when you will update the resume in a proper way you will start getting the call why you are not getting the call because what corporate is expecting you are not writing so after doing this course you have to update so you watch my video there you will come to know how to prepare the resume so there i have explained in detail got that idea so that was a magic so there is no reason someone can reject you after having this practical knowledge <clears throat> who can enroll students freshers trainee interns someone who wants to make the career or someone who is already working like in any profile and can learn any course from me so suggestion for the students you know i really appreciate people you know who is doing you know the best time to do this course is when they are doing their last year <clears throat> and for mba they are doing the first year first inter, uh, first semester second semester not the last semester for graduation degree last year and for mba the first year because i am sharing the practical knowledge and you are learning the theoretical knowledge so you will understand more in detail so when you combine practical with theoretical 100% now you are complete man or uh, girl lady whatever you can say got it so that is my suggestion degree with knowledge is equal to good the best career <clears throat> you can see the google review i'm going to launch the hr topper from once again the hr topper from 5th of the october that is tomorrow so meanwhile you can go to the google review for hr buddy which still course is going on you can see <clears throat> the review okay i'm not telling you to read right now but you can go and watch all the reviews that people have given so that you get some kind of confidence whether you should do or not got it dear so these are few there are many reviews you can go and watch it <clears throat> google drive you will get all the notes notes will be in pdf the format template that i will share will be the actual one word file or excel file so let me show you how you will get the notes <clears throat> the moment you make the payment i will share you the share you the notes example when you go to go to your shared with me okay can you see this payroll and generalist payroll and generalist so that is a course that has been assigned for just click on it right click and download the moment you click on download here it will start downloading it gets downloaded in your download option so let's go to the download option can you see this download option so the notes will be downloaded in the winzip file you have to right click and click on extract here the moment you click the winzip will convert into a folder can you see the folder now everything is there it's just an example <clears throat> all the formats everything is there done now what you have to do the folder that you have extracted you can go to the google drive and click on my drive that is your drive just click on my drive and click on new and 
upload upload the file that you have downloaded so just click here and say upload the moment you upload the folder will be saved in your drive permanently so your data your notes is saved safely got it see it got saved you can download any time later on so i have shown you the method <clears throat> The certificate, once you complete, I'll share the certificate like this to you in PDF and JPG. JPG is to share with the social media and PDF, you can keep it with you. You can take a, a color printout and keep it. No issue at all. If you want to see a demo, I don't give demo, but I'll show you the, uh, you know, YouTube where you can go and watch the live session instead of demo session. Trailer is different and movie is different. So why don't you watch the movie, then pay the ticket like that. <clears throat> registration how you have to do the registration is if you want to choose any course then go to the hrtopper.com you visit all the courses are there here you can download the brochure here you can click and go to the course content you, you can see the course content here <clears throat> payroll course all the details of the payroll generalist course all the details of the generalist recruitment course details and MS office details. Okay. <clears throat> Go to the last here. I have put that same live session. You can watch it. This is a payment detail and frequently asked question. You can watch, you can see, and this is a registration form. Even in the website, even in the website, if you go to the last one here, there is a registration. The moment you click the registration form, the Google form will open here you have to choose which one live you want or recorded you want you can choose any one course and submit it once you submit i'll get the information you have to just whatsapp me whatsapp me that you have registered the moment you do the uh, whatsapp me i will tell you what amount you have to pay payment process so payment detail is also there on my website <clears throat> You can do Google Pay, Phone Pay, Paytm on this number, or you have to do only IMPS if you're doing from the bank. No NFT, no RTGs, only IMPS because it gets immediately. NFT and RTGs may take some time. So I don't want to get into that. Do only IMPS. Even you can make the payment via credit card using the bank details. Got it? There is no link for the credit card. <clears throat> Once you make the payment, share the screenshot on the WhatsApp number. Once you share the screenshot, I will give you the access to the videos. For example, once you make the payment, how to do the sign up? There is an option called here in the website, sign up. <clears throat> you have to fill the form. Okay. While choosing the password, please do not write the password which you are using currently anywhere. No, because this password I can see, our team can see. So you should not write your password which you are using already don't do that mistake am i clear don't do that mistake once you sign up click it submit it done once you sign up just share in the whatsapp key sign up process is completed the moment you do i will give you the access after some time and you can then sign in after sign up immediately don't sign in and say I cannot view the videos. No, that is not correct. The once you sign up, I have to give access. No, the admin person has to give access to watch the video. Then I'll confirm on the WhatsApp that the access is given and I'll share you the screenshot. Okay, which course I've given you the access. What is the date and end date? Both I'll give it to you. So you have to go to this website and sign in now. <clears throat> you have to use your email ID that you have chosen and the password, email ID and password. Once you log in, this is my admin access. You can see all this category list. Okay. You can see this category list. Suppose I've given you the payroll weekend batch as a recorded session. You can click here. There are so many options. Just in a, click anywhere. You will see the video live session. So this is the live session of the previous batch or the previous batch. What is recording, you know, which have, in the last two years, which one was the best one where I've shared more knowledge, more experience. I have put it out here. 2 plus 2, 2 years back was 4, today also it is 4. So knowledge is same. So you should not feel, key, sir, this is uh, 6 months back or example, hypothetically, 1 year back. That is not the right answer. The answer is 2 plus 2 is 4, today also it is 4. So the process remains the same. Whichever, whichever the best one I have chosen, 
here. So you can see the videos. <clears throat> Click on that and start watching the video. Many videos I've put. It's more than 90 hours. So don't worry. So this is a way you can watch. Okay, done. <clears throat> so we as I have a specialized course for recruitment, 50 hours, generalist 50 hours, payroll, 90, 100 hours, uh, payroll plus compliance, both 100 hours, MS office, 33 hours as of now. So these are five courses. I, I have many others also, but these are the five most specialized course, which you can do from me. So if you do that course, you will have more knowledge. Uh, sorry, I can say 60% of my knowledge I'm sharing with you. Now imagine a fresher having 60% knowledge of a 19 years experience. That is enough for your lifetime. That is enough to change your life and career. Got it? <clears throat> if you want to apply register, you can WhatsApp me immediately and start the course. I hope the information was useful and see you very soon. Thank you, dear.